Hello everyone, we are back with Alan Wake episode, I think episode 10. By episode 10, I mean the playthrough part 10, and this is episode uh, 3 or 4. <laughs> That's kind of confusing. Anyways, welcome back. Hey yo, I thought we did this already. Ah! I guess it didn't load the other section. Oh man, I thought, it, I thought we slowed it on the correct section, I guess not. Well, I guess we'll do this again. Oh boy, Bobby. It's one of them. Wow, this one's pretty full. It's kind of... We've charged our batteries. I really don't want to waste batteries. Uh, I'm just looking at which area. Right? Wow. Okay. This time I didn't get achievement for this one, but that's fine. Goodness, scared the freaking crap out of me. Again, this this game is sometimes very, very loud for no reason whatsoever. You got keys to the house. Well, it kind of loaded to s the same place. We have to watch... Well, we don't have to watch the television again, so... We might still use the hunting rifle. And ammo. Yeah, we just skip this. Outside of riding is a struggle. And we'll grab one of these. I managed to make my way downstairs. Really? There's a shoebox filled with books and papers by Thomas Zane. It's very hard to focus, but I managed to read some of okay. it. Okay. And a good one. He writes of um. Look at those. All the pines. This darkness has to be stopped, man. You know why it doesn't stop? Because you keep writing about it, man. But who's actually writing it? Because I don't know... How, you don't know who's writing it. Other than yourself. But then you don't know how you're writing it. Because you're not even there. Or are you? Who honestly knows? But you know what I can say? You're crazy. I'm crazy. Nightingale, the FBI agent's crazy. Is he part of the FBC? Federal Bureau of Control? I don't know. Oh, goodness. The kidnapper had sent me a text. The message was full of spelling errors and insults. Wow. It was telling me to hurry up. Seems like a little bit of a uneducated immaturity that needs to get some check ups or some sort. I don't know if the lights went into the... Hold on, I'm sorry for doing this. It just sh it showed over here, but it could be wrong, you know? It could be say, hey, you go this way instead. Oh, I might be right, actually. See, see, and then here. It doesn't mean to go up here. It means to go down here. Aha. Nearly missed it. Nearly missed it. We got a flare gun. Four. I could have got six ammo, but I missed out on two ammo things when the last checked on that recording. It's really quick of just how bad I am at games and memory. I use, I'm not usually that bad at games. I, I can play around a lot, but... Birds. Um. Okay. We got it. Eventually. Ah, uh, they're so far away now. I don't think we can... No, they're too far. They might try to loop back when I go into this little section right here. Oh, boy. Okay. Ah, oh, so close. Well, we got some of them out of here. Are you really kidding me? It's because I went to this thing, and which I don't know why I'm trying to come back into it. They're happy you like that? Do not make me use the flare. I mean, if you want to play like this, I'll do it. But, kind of weird, you know. Okay, okay, okay. Pretty good. Man, I feel like this is abusive, but at the same time, it's not my fault. The game made me do this. Ah, uh, here's something. Careful. I should probably fire. Uh, yeah. I don't know if that's good enough.
Ooh, careful. I think we're good. I oh, boy. Oh, oh, oh. Well, now I think I had to restart the whole process of the crows or ravens. Oh, my goodness. I apologize. Birds. Get track. I just realized, too. Pow. Okay, we got rid of some of them. Maybe. But then we need to go back for the ammunition. Hurry up. Oh, that's, that's kind of unfortunate that it does that. Wait. Does it now? I see four ammo. Wait, there's one. That's four grenades. Ah, yeah. That's unfortunate. Dude, I, I just went downhill. Are you tired already? I, I don't know what to say about this. I think your stamina is as bad as mine, and I don't work out ever. I think I've worked out, the last time I worked out was, uh, in high school. Like, legitimately worked out, worked out, like, on a schedule. Because, uh, you know, in high school, in freshman year, you're forced to have gym as a class course, so... After that, it's no more gym. People might be like, you gotta work out, my guy. Get the gains. I'm like, dude, I'm freaking... I'm not ripped. Definitely not fat anymore. Look, some, some cruises, you go to cruise too many times, and then you get... Hello? Get a little bit chunky. A little bit overweight a little bit, I guess. But, oh freaking heck me. Um, where did the, where did you guys come from? I don't know if they just infinitely spawn, so I should just say whatever with we'll this. Oh. Help. What is this? Maybe they just spawn infinitely. But with proper dieting, I've lost 25 pounds, so... There you go. Down to 160. Let's go back to 150, shall we? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm sorry for doing this. I, I said myself, just go, because they probably spawn infinitely, but I just call myself completely. As you see. That was freaking fun. Sarcasm is real. Um, I gotta check them out on the tour. Just in case something crazy is going on. Like, what if I wasn't recording the whole time? And I'll be like, man. You idiot. Okay. I don't know why I go back. Because, like, you're gonna forget something? Like, it's gonna hide a little manuscript, maybe. I don't think so. I know, go. Tunnels go to Codron Lake. Okay. Creepy Alice, I guess. Oh, man. Well, there might be a... The voice is Alice. It goes down here. No, 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 no. There's a pathway up here, man. Oh, man. Is there a pathway actually? It is. Why do you do this? Oh, crap. The voice comes here, too. What is this? We got some flares. See that the flares, normal flares, aren't as powerful as they used to be. Well, if I go down, I can't go back up, I guess. What a hindrance, man. You're joking me with that. Does that hurt me? You know what? There you go. Look, that one like a champ. I swear, man. Here, here. I, I bring the hunting rifle out. Because you want it really much. Don't worry, I don't have a hair trigger. Unlike Nightingale. I can hold back. And realize that, hey, I had my safety on and I didn't even have my hand on the trigger to begin with. So what you doing? Oh. Without warning, the headache stabbed at my brain. Uh-oh. This is a this is a scene. This is the thing you wrote, didn't you? Judging by which, this is 
Oh, maybe this is not just. Okay. This is Cauldron Lake underneath. Oh boy. I'm losing it. I gotta get out of here. You say that. Oh, don't do it. Don't do it. Just don't do it. Just don't do it. You don't think there's a secret here because I think it's just D E A T H. There you go. That's your secret. Now get the heck out of here before you do something seriously stupid. Hunter's taken. The hunters were big, thick set men, confident and at home in the woods. They were feeling good, running on beer, ghost stories, and camaraderie late into the night. It did them no good, as they were taken by the dark presence, sucked deep into a darkness far worse than any ghost story they ever told or heard. I should have probably checked my avatar to see if I'm actually blocking things i know i blocked the bottom right there's nothing on the bottom right except for maybe like theme stuff achievements friends activities etc other than that you know nothing much usually i hope i don't block the whole half of the side of the screen sometimes i make myself large for some reason sometimes i don't know what i'm doing so bear with me It's all work in progress until somebody can kindly give me some free feedback. A little constructive feedback maybe and then I'll see what I can do. But I will not change how I do stuff like commentary wise or... Um, stuff. Maybe I'll... If you recommend a game I'll play. Come on, you got this palette? Never mind. But other than that, you know, it's like I tried before to be like... A normal commentator commentating like esports or like just a normal commentary and it just didn't work out because it's just not me i'm a goofy dude what am i talking about even behind the closed doors and curtains of his grimy room at the majestic the local motel nightingale could feel the locals eyes on him the unrelenting pressure of their judgment he forced it out of his mind for all he knew they could all be under wake spell already you do what you have to do to get the job done. He took comfort from the bottle in his hand. Please, he thought. Just let me get through this. Dude. I guess you're an alcoholic. That suffered past trauma related to this nonsense. For some reason, you think ending someone who could be potentially innocent and had no idea what they're doing. is the answer to your problems, which is fudged up, man. Wow. Um. Yeah, you didn't want some of this, man. I swear. Remember your shovel, buddy? Oh, where'd you guys come from, huh? Hey, come on. Hey. Chill. Ah, that's not what I wanted to do. Well, all right, you and me, one-on-one, -on -one, my guy, let's go. What do you have, a sledgehammer? That's cute. I'm adorable. Pow, pow. Is that an actual, is this the aim? I need to try this eventually when I have bullets. That was a... I would say it was to be a headshot, but other than that, it, this, the flashlight might be the cursor aim. I could be wrong though, because he does shoot at the dudes, even if I'm not aiming directly at them. I'll have to test this and play around with his aiming, but at the meantime, I mean, what can you do? I gotta get out of there, he says, without Alice, even though that was his primary goal. Let's well, so just plug the, sh the kidnapper, which is, again, these people and their hair triggers, man. 
Like, you couldn't literally say a thing to the I'd people. I'd have to make my way up this mine shaft in order to go on. Maybe the machinery could help me with that. You know, there's the Sheriff Baker. She could have helped you, but you wanted to be uncooperative, uncoo apparently. Apparently, that's always the thing. But you know what? If he's not cooperative, then no story. What am I doing? Good enough to me. Oh. Little rusty girders. Little rusty ladder. And some crusty footsteps or something. Oh, okay. It's here? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, careful. It is. That's cool. Wow. Huh? Okay. Uh, I guess that's right here. Yeah, it looks about right. Is it, though? Oh, it is. Okay. That, yeah, that was the other area that we went to. You didn't really have to jump that much, man. Careful, please. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Okay, that's what it was. I thought we'd keep going up. You just go down instead. This game does have, like, a slight weirdness to it. Like, kind of like, uh, you know, like... It's not scary per se it's more like thrilling you know there's like you don't want to get it's like you know whatever don't want to admit it's scary he says <laughs> uh, i mean outlast was more scary but it wasn't scary because it was it was weird outlast trials was not it's not like an outlast solo campaign game it it's fun with friends but it's not like outlast in my opinion Not really scary. Up or down? Oh man. Let's try to peekaboo what's going up, down, and left. A lot of bullets there, but up is. What's up? Through it, let's go up. Because there's only one way up, which is down. What? There's only one way up, which is up. It's only one way later on, which is down. Okay, there you go. The English has finally settled in, maybe. A manuscript. I would have missed it. Okay. I don't... Oh. Wow. Wow. Okay. Pop poop. Oh. Oh, the facepalm. What did you expect from this, man? You thought that you would survive when you fell like a little baby inch. But now, when you decide to go up like maybe 12 feet, you say, like, hey, we can do it. Is it 12 feet? Let's see. That's about 20 feet. No, 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 no. That's about 18 feet. That's like... Ah, you know what? Whatever. I'll focus again if I miss anything that comes out with this. I don't think it did, or you know what, whatever. What is it? Like, I would assume this man's six feet something, maybe five feet eight to six feet two. 175 ish. I don't freaking know what am I saying. No, whatever. Lightning flashed behind the windows of Cauldron Lake Lodge. Tor Anderson laughed and held the steel hammer above his head. Nurse Sinclair was trying to calm him down without success. Tor grinned madly and shouted, My hammer's up. Here's a friendly poke from Mulnir, wench. He brought the hammer down with all his might on Sinclair's head. We're on a comeback tour, baby. Mulnir. Mulnir. Hmm.
Yep. I declined myself on that one. Because then I would have to do the whole thing over again if I died. Hey! Okay. I better watch out because they could actually just revive infinitely. If it's just the same section as before, they could just do the same thing over and over. So I might have wasted that flare gun. It's pretty strong. It's as good as the flashbang grenade. There we go. Just... Oh, great. Another cable car. Just great. Oh. Okay, hold on. This was what all it- wait. What? Uh, I guess this was- wait, why does it look so different? Wait, I'm sorry. Oh, okay, it was the same section. Oh my goodness, be careful, man. Assume the inevitable. Nothing auspicious whatsoever, right? Oh, golly! Oh! Get the hell dead, I guess. Oh, boy. I'm fine. Look, they're so far away. I'm not even close, but you know what? They don't seem to be attacking. Nice. Um, what? Always the last minute, they say. That is... Oh, oh golly, that's creepy. I can't even see what's going on. Oh, the cable's gone. Oh, the screen. Ah! Oh. Oh. Hello? Hey, that's 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 actually disrespectful. Like I just fell off the Uh it it is the it is the aim, but it's not at the same time. He does like it's he auto aims, but at the same time Let's see. Uh, it's a it's really wide. I guess this flashlight. I mean, it's uh, whatever. You know what I mean? It is the cursor. This is the aim But when I was trying to aim last time man, I was just terrible then Ah uh, Shit Where why? Ow Nice. What do we have here? What is this? Oh, revolver ammo? And more revolver ammo. Oh. Ah! Oopsie, sorry. I love how that... That, that first can... That last can that stood up was like, I'm immortal, and then they're like, I'm dead. <laughs> Anyways, I don't know what the heck I'm doing. As always. What else is new, my dude? Oh, okay. This is ominous. I sense an enemy coming through, I believe. That's lovely. Okay. Yeah, they're gonna spawn soon. As in, immediately. Oh, wow! That's a lot of sound. Hey! I hate your stink. What the? Oh! Nice duck. You caught me for sure. Oh man, it's one of these days where it just continually spawns, huh? Ugh! 
Oh man, we don't. Okay, don't pick up the revolver ammo. We might go back. Probably not, but we'll see. No, Cauldron Lake. The eighth deepest lake in the world, Cauldron Lake, is a caldera lake formed in a volcanic crater. The volcano itself could be considered to be active, but has not erupted since the volcanic earthquakes of 1970. And even then, the underground activity was comparably mild. Despite some property damage, there were no casualties. Cauldron Lake is one of the most beautiful spots in the Bright Falls area, as well as a central figure in many local folk tales. It's a popular recreational area for the area residents. E. I gotta click E, not escape. What is this, like, stone that's like a mountain? And why do I do this? This stone right here. Okay. Oh, careful, man. Okay, I guess nothing here. Which means don't explore anymore. We don't need to do it. I got... I'm gonna do one thing right here, actually. Just in case. I mean, I could just turn off the music in general. I don't want to hear it, though. There you go. That was really quick. Just in case, you know. Oh, golly, man. Oh, boy. Oh, man. I guess you don't want to run through this or use the handrails. Fine. Um. Ha. Ha, you're funny. Hey! Ooh. Oh. Dude, you're really gonna get it now. That guy, I, I'll get him last time. Next time. Last time. A sledge boy again, really? What do you think you're gonna do, huh? I'm not afraid to take a stand. Come take my hand, man. Yeah? What'd I tell you? The shovel man couldn't touch me. You think you're gonna touch me? I thought he touched me. Oh! Oh! Wow, man. What'd it be? That's like Dragon Ball. Like, you're so arrogant and cocky, and then that's what you get at the end. <laughs> you fudged up, you idiot. Holy crap. Anyways. You're unstoppable. You have so much power, and then you get... It's called the price of having a big ego. Your ego's too big, they say. Greatest downfall of mankind. Ego. Pride. And wokeness. You could be woke, but why so woke, you know? Why am I talking about it? I like the woke generation, but sometimes too woke is too weird. You lose all logic of common sense and actual reality sometimes. I just don't know what I'm talking about still. I think I'm spring on a tangent of the satire, which is uh, my novel. Which is woke up itself, but it's not that woke. What am I doing? I'm not I at the Cauldron Lake. all of Stucky's rental cabins. There had been no sign of the wakes. It was dark when he'd found their car parked at the end of the road by Cauldron Lake. It made no sense. They must have taken a wrong turn. But there was no sign of them. And the car had been there for hours already. Frustrated, Mott stood on the rotten ruin of the footbridge that had once led to Diver's Isle before it sank beneath the waves years ago. The boss wouldn't be happy. Um... Stucky is... I don't know what happened to him other than Alan Wake did something. I could've left him alone. Could've left him alone. What the? Okay. Duh. Huh. Kick? 
Push. Nice shoulder. Holy freaking moly. Kick. Hey, yep. I guess it wouldn't have been... Okay, it might have been less safe to try to jump and climb it. Or climb here, I guess. <laughs> and kick this, and then do that. Which, you know what, whatever. Hey, look, look. I'm judging Alan Wick a lot lately. But, you know what, this guy... He's rude to his wife. Wife that just wanted to support and, care, support and care for this dude. Having a rider's block. You wouldn't think that Alice would be your muse, but I guess not. You're mean to Rose, who's just a fan. Maybe it's a stan, but at the same time, come on now. He's not going to be like a real stan and just like... Do 90 on the freeway. With a fit for Waka. Kick. What? Oh boy, oh boy. Tom. I miss you, Tom. T.W. And Tom. Tom is Zane. Okay. Who's C.W. though? Not Barbara. Barbara Jagger. What's that? I curse you, Thomas Zane. Well... Where did you... Did you write this? I miss you, Tom. You talk to, t to me on TV, Tom. Okay, who's CW? I need to recognize who's who. I thought I saw something else besides this. You know what, whatever. Let's go. I feel like I missed something. Hey, yo. Why did I pick that up? Hey, nice. So, ammunition is plenty. I love it. What is this over here? Body ammo. Don't mind if I do. But I think we're going to stop it right here. This might be a shorter episode than usual. But then again, it's 30 minutes, I think. But that's alright. I'll see you guys in the next one. Hope you guys enjoyed. See ya.